Good evening, Tim. That's right. I'm at the West Texas Rehabilitation Center's Conference Center, where the San Angelo Independent School District hosted their last Engaging Equity Summit, where members of the community were able to gather at a social distance and discuss the possible renaming or retention of Robert E. Lee Middle School in San Angelo. If we're going to change the name of Lee, let's change them all. For months, the San Angelo Independent School District has been hosting events and inviting members of the community to engage in conversation surrounding the possible renaming or retention of Robert E. Lee Middle School in San Angelo. On September 15th, the district held their last Engaging Equity Summit sessions at the West Texas Rehabilitation Center, where locals were able to give comment regarding who should be involved in a possible renaming. The school board should be the one that decides Anyone that's local, I think, should have a say-so or a voice. What a school should be named after. Mostly that a local, state, or national geographic area should be considered for a school name um, because it really does represent our community. And what the name of a school means to its students, staff, and community. So it's not the name itself. It's, it's the atmosphere and that that comes with that name of being under common ground. SAISD Superintendent Carl Detloff says an advisory council will gather information from all of the Engaging Equity Summits, letters and emails sent to the district, and comments made at school board meetings and present key findings to the board of trustees who will ultimately decide what the next step is, whether it's renaming, retaining, or scheduling more public summits. Like I said before, these sessions on the 15th are the last Engaging Equity Summit sessions. However, if a member of the community wants to have more input, you can always contact the district or attend a board meeting, and that schedule can be found on SAISD.org. We'll have all the updates to come on Fox West Texas. Reporting for Fox West Texas, I'm Liv Johnson.